I'm Laura Carmichael and I play Muriel Williams. Muriel is Ruth's sister um, and she is the one who encourages Ruth to go with her to the dance, to the missionary dance, which is where she meets Serezze. She's a missionary, she's involved with the church and um, do-gooding um, and yeah, she's very fond of, of these dances and is very involved there and um, I don't think she expects you know, in our story, um, for for Ruth to come along and, and fall in love and um, end up marrying Sorette. But uh, that's that's how it all um, how it all goes. Muriel wasn't against this marriage; she was for it. But she was aware that the difficulties that they were facing were not going to go away. And you know, we know that Muriel said years later that her and her mother still got rude letters sent to them about the marriage. It's always interesting when you're playing a real life character, you want to really honour them um, and find out as much as you can about them. And then you sort of have to go into your script and see what the story we're telling here and what's going to be, you know, useful in this point. There are some brilliant books out there, and Emma brought me a lot of information. And in fact, Muriel, Muriel only passed away a couple of years ago. But I loved it. I've, I've loved researching the role. It's been great. It's a, it's a very in, important story. It's unbelievable that it happened, um, that they endured so much, this couple. It's really important to show these people who overcame that. Working, you know, with a lot of these brilliant uh, black British actors, they we're talking just now about how special it is for them to do period drama. It doesn't happen. There aren't many opportunities, and um, that's ridiculous, <laughs> really. So it feels very special and very normal, and like this should happen more often, I think. This movie has so many brilliant qualities to it. It's this political drama, this real life story that we should all know about. And then on top of that, it's a really beautiful romance film. And I think audiences will really connect with these characters and, and fall in love with them, I think. It's been so lovely working with Rosamund. She's such a, a brilliant actor and um, I was very excited to be working with her. She's enchanting, I think, um, as Ruth. And you, I think it will be easy to see how she's um, irresistible for Sorette. It's that sort of free spirit and, and light-heartedness that she has that I think is, is really attractive. And, and she's very brave, you know. Um, and I think different from, from, other, from other heroines we see on screen, you know, I think she's a very normal, normal girl, but um, she goes through a lot and puts up a lot because she's so in love with him. I loved the script when I read it. It's such an incredible story. Um, and I was very surprised I hadn't heard of it before. There's so many elements to it. It's this beautiful romance and incredible political story as well. That feels quite unique. I don't think I've ever seen anything like that before. And yeah, I think to tell this true story as well as, as brilliantly as the script does, I think it's very special. David is, is so wonderful. I mean, he's He's just a very inspiring actor. He's very prepared, he's very measured and very respectful. And yeah, he comes with this, this great knowledge. And um, I think that's perfect for this part as well, this very educated man 
he was a great speaker and um, a very inspirational figure. And, you know, I found that being around David, I think he's a very, very special actor. The scenes where he's speaking to the crowds, I've, I, I really love that. I think he's got a very special quality um, with that. It's always great to work with a director you know who's been living and breathing this story and this script for such a long time and you can feel how important it is to her to get every moment right and that's incredibly helpful when you're coming to a project. It's been great working with Emma. She's, she's really fun and uh, has a very fun attitude on the set. I can't, I can't wait to see it. I really can't. I've loved being in the 40s. Um, the clothes are really fun. There's a lot that I would wear today, I think. Um, and the sets have been great. The, um, you know, I've obviously done a lot in the home, um, which was set at Ealing Studios. And, yeah, it, was, it felt like my, my nana's house, you know. I felt um, very authentic.